Hello, I'm Dr. Bernadine Cruz. Did you know that 85% of dogs and cats over four years of age suffer from periodontal disease? Periodontal disease, just as in humans, begins with mild inflammation of the gums and can progress to tooth loss, dental abscesses, and serious body-wide infections. Don't expect your dog to show signs of pain. He or she may just not want to eat a hard biscuit, may have bad breath, a bit of oral bleeding, or just simply seem off. It's up to you, the pet parent, to interpret the signs that all is not well with your pooch and to do the best you can to prevent painful conditions from ever occurring. What can you do to prevent dental disease in your dog, and when should you start? Although feeding your dog dry, crunchy food and specially formulated treats can certainly help to minimize the tartar buildup, this is not a replacement for daily brushing. So how do you brush your dog's teeth? Start by examining your dog's mouth. Gently lift the lips and look at the teeth and gums. The gums should be pink and form a tight seal with the teeth. The teeth should be white and smooth. Next, take a sniff. 95% of bad breath is due to plaque, tartar, and poor dental health. Next, find a quiet place where you won't be disturbed and a time when you won't be rushed. Rub your finger over your dog's mouth and teeth. Work with the mouth for short periods of time and each session with lots of verbal praise and a treat or two. After your dog is resigned to the fact that you're going to play with his mouth and he's decided it really isn't that bad, apply a small amount of pet denifrous to your finger and rub your coated finger over its teeth. Pet toothpaste is okay to swallow because it has less fluoride than our toothpaste and it doesn't foam. Toothpaste come in pet-friendly flavors and some even have enzymes that kill the plaque-producing bacteria. Next comes a toothbrush. Again, patience and time are needed. Let him or her play with this new toy. Brush all the teeth, especially the ones in the back of the mouth. If the brush is not acceptable to your dog, you can use a finger cot or even a clean wash rag wrapped around your finger. There is no need to brush the inside aspect of the teeth. The tongue will keep this area clean. Make sure when you're done to reward your dog with lots of TLC and maybe a tartar-reducing biscuit. Eventually, he or she will look forward to this daily ritual. Put the bite back in your dog's bark. Start a dental program today. All it takes is a little bit of time, some yummy treats, veterinary-approved dental products, some patience, and oh yeah, a good sense of humor never hurt either. Even with excellent at-home dental care, your dog will still periodically need professional dental care from your veterinarian. Does your pet need professional assistance now? Just ask your veterinarian. I'm Dr. Bernadine Cruz for Pet Care TV.